How must a global corporation be arranged nowadays? Which methods and tools can it use in order to meet the requirements around the globe at all its business locations in the same way? The more than 180 participants at the 2011 annual conference in Stuttgart discussed the contribution that MTM can make as an internationally recognized process language in the plenary sessions and in many personal discussions too. Using the motto from practice for practice, experts from various sectors provided a glimpse of productivity management at their corporations. Malgorzata Jarczyoch, the factory manager at the BSH laundry dryer factory in Łódź in Poland, described the advantages of jointly using BSH production system and MTM tools on the new production line for heat pumps, for example. Markus Kraus, the production planner at Brosa, underlined the importance of a unified planning methodology for the globally unified planning process in product development and production and in pre-production, logistics, quality management or spare parts production. MTM as a process language determines the work structure precisely and documents the work process so that we can then use it at all our factories and with other planners too. I think that is the great benefit, this clear process language, this clarity in the analysis process. Frank Stromberger from Daimler Trucks and Julian Shallow from Dortmund University of Technology introduced a data model which allows time data to be exchanged between the time management department and the other planning areas at a digital factory. Trends in a global competitive environment in the automobile industry and the role of MTM were the subject of Professor Dr. Bernd Wilhelm's lecture. Not only creating international standards, but also using and living them and working together in an interdisciplinary way. They are some of the most important tasks of a productivity manager today, according to Dr. Andreas Lauermann from VW. Internationalization therefore plays an important role because the markets of the future are unfortunately no longer all situated in Europe, which is our home base and will continue to be so. So we have a great deal of work to do. As we are always focusing on growth and want to sell our cars around the globe, we actually need the same basis in every country around the world. So a process language like MTM naturally provides the ideal condition to manage this and finally achieve it. The other aspect which is crucial with a unified process language is not just internationalization, but also the integration of various specialist departments. The demands placed on industrial engineering increase through internationalization and therefore the demands on training too. Professor Dr. Uwe Dombrowski at Braunschweig University of Technology is working with colleagues all over Europe to introduce an international advanced industrial management master's degree. The course is designed to use innovative teaching methods to communicate methodological skills and information about digital tools and enable the students to handle management responsibility faster. Dombrowski knows time is short. There's already a need to act. We had a shortfall of 80,000 engineers at the end of September, according to an Association of German Engineers study. And we need to tap into this university area from a German point of view now, because we will not be able to fill this gap just from universities in Germany. Management expertise was also Dr. Thorsten Schumacher's subject. He provided an entertaining and informative final session to explain what characterizes the best manager in his view. An ability to listen, providing feedback in real time, drawing consequences and showing appreciation. The training agreement with the MTM chapter in Portugal and the ATEC Training Institute was extended for another two years during the annual conference. The election of the new German MTM Association board also took place. Dr. Gerhard Wischmann and Professor Bernd Wilhelm were presented the MTM award for their many years of commitment and did not stand again. The newly elected members of the board are Dr. Andreas Laumann, Volkswagen AG, and Alexander Dahm, Airbus Operations GmbH. Frank Kindhorst from Heller and Alfred Schmunt from Daimler were made MTM fellows for their services in spreading and using the MTM process language. There were also four recognition prizes for young MTM users. They went to Michael Moran, Nikolai Thiel, Hong Wang and Dr. Dominic Petzold. <laughs>